Knowledge and wisdom is for everyone, and it's something that shouldn't have a price tag. At Get Wisdom Channel, you get free knowledge and tips that you can quickly remember and share with everyone. To support our channel, visit Get Wisdom store at WePresent.com and pick a perfect t-shirt for you and your loved ones. P.S. To open your own store at WePresent.com, click here. Television, as many other inventions, is a result of work of many people from the late 19th and early 20th century. The aim was to deliver a device that superseded previous technology from different reasons. Some were compelled to capitalize on the invention and make profit, while others wanted to change the world through visual and audio communication technology. Throughout its existence, television went and still goes through different stages from mechanical, electronic, color, to digital, smart, and 3D. The first television was based on mechanical scanning of graphics, which took place in early 19th century. Scottish inventor Alexander Bain introduced the facsimil machine whose transmission system was developed by Italian Giovanni Caselli that later pioneered methods of mechanical television. Many other people contributed bits by bits to development and existence of mechanical television through their inventions. The electronic television was based on a cathode ray tube whose earliest version was invented by German physicist Carl Ferdinand Braun. And just like with the mechanical television, electronic television was made by different people's inventions. However, the world's first 625 television standard was designed in Soviet Union in 1944 and became a national standard in 1946. The concept of 625 lines per frame was subsequently implemented in the Europe CCIR standard. In 1936, Kalman Tihani described the principle of plasma display the first flat panel display system, while only in 1978 James Pitchell described, prototyped and demonstrated what was maybe the earliest monochromatic flat panel LED television display targeted at replacing the cathode ray tube. The basic idea of using three monochrome images to produce a color image had been experimented with almost as soon as black and white televisions had first been built. Although all electronic color was introduced in 1953 in the US, the acceptance was slow due to high prices and all local programming was in black and white anyways. Then, only in mid-60s, Color sets started selling in large numbers due to the announced color transition for all network primetime broadcasts. So the all color season came in 1972. Digital television meant that both audio and video transmission happens by digitally processed and multiplexed signal. So digital TV can support more than one program in the same channel bandwidth and represents first evolution in television technology since color. Digital television transition started in the late 2000s when all governments across the world set the deadline for analog shutdown by 2010. Now, the advent of digital television allowed innovations like smart TVs, which is a television set with integrated internet and Web 2.0 features. So smart TV enables internet TV, online interactive media, on-demand streaming media, and home networking access. These TVs come with preloaded operating systems. The first patent was filed in 1994 for an intelligent television system that linked with data processing systems by means of a digital or analog network. Then, even though 3D television was introduced recently, the first stereoscopic 3D television was demonstrated in 1920s by John Baird. Digital TV definitely enabled further development of 3D TV, which failed to make inroads among the public. <laughs>